I swear by this cake recipe tenfold. Welcome back to another episode of The Produce Chronicles. And right now, rhubarb is in season. So let's get some. Now, my favorite thing about rhubarb, if you've never had it, is it's sweet and tart and it's sexy in a lot of desserts. It's usually paired with strawberries. We're going to do an olive oil cake. And you want to make sure you're actually not buying red Swiss chard because you will be disappointed like any date with a Gemini man. And if you're a tourist moon like me and care about aesthetics, you want to go for the forced rhubarb, which is going to give that beautiful red color. Then you can toss it with flour and chuck it into a grease pan. Or arrange it beautifully. I don't judge, but your boo will. If you want to impress someone, I swear by an olive oil cake. It will make anyone feel so loved and held. And as a people pleaser, when are you not trying to impress someone? And with any olive oil cake, you always want to add a little citrus. So mixing together the zest with some sugar is always going to enhance that flavor. Then you can add your eggs or apple sauce for a great vegan alternative, some milk, and a high quality olive oil. Oh, and don't forget the almond extra. And once it's baked, you can flip it over. I love doing that in front of someone and then serving it with some Ooh. lebnet. I made this for my mom and she loved it. I could say it is a moist, sweetly tart, wonderful lily fragrance dessert as I am.